held a press conference commemorating the end of the so-called brood war some four years ago. Our own Kate Lockwell was on the scene. Sir, do you still stand by the sentiment that selfless devotion to the people is the basis of your rule? Well, of course. I was called upon to serve the greater interest of humanity. Personal power was never my goal. Then how would you characterize this statement? I will not be stopped. Not by you or the Confederate or anyone. I will rule this sector or see it burnt to ashes around me. Uh, I will stay for this. You jackals think you can come in here and question me? This interview is over. You're playing a dangerous game here, kid. Speaking of which, you might particularly enjoy this next step. You've taken half the fleet. Care to explain yourself, boy? Father, I am about to accomplish that which you never could. Today, I will secure peace throughout the Dominion. By this act, the people will finally know that I will be a better emperor and a better man. I love your gumption, son, but your hand wave over your head. What makes you think you have the experience to... Being alone, Arcturus. Marina. This is Kerrigan. What? You're not just gonna leave her. You can get me back. I don't know what gutter my son fished you out of, but even you got to realize that treacherous bitch cannot be saved. And neither can you. I want Marina's head, you understand? About time we kick this revolution into overdrive. I will not be stopped. Not by you or the Confederate or anyone. I will rule this sector or see it burnt to ashes around me. It ain't over till it's over, you son of a bitch. All transmissions have been sent, sir. Every world in the Dominion just got a UNN special bulletin about Minsk. You know, I love CDM score, but the Dominion's just gonna spin this like they do everything else. Not this time. Don't you see? Minsk used the media as a weapon for years, and now we've turned it against him. One broadcast. You want us a bigger victory than a hundred battles? That was our real victory today. You know, Matt, someday you're gonna wind up leading this bunch of misfits. Hearts and minds, man. Just like you always said. <laughs>